This is Tom Lehman, Doe Doctor. I'm back at you again. This time we're going to talk a little bit about Sarasota Flower, one of our gracious sponsors of, these video, of this video series. This one here, the all-purpose Sarasota, it's been around for just about forever. That's one of their oldest brands. A newer rendition to the Sarasota uh, line is their high protein. So both of these are excellent flowers. This would be used for probably 75% of your pizza production. It works just great. It's very popular for Chicago style pizzas. If you happen to be using long fermentation times, uh, for example, we're looking at maybe going for three, four, five days fermentation, this would be a very good one. It's a high, good high protein flour, very strong flour. New, brand new to Sarasota are some double O flowers. These are real Italian. These are Italian mill double O flowers. And what we have here, we have a blue. Just think of it as a blue label or a blue bag. And this one here is a, it's a lower protein. Uh, it's around 11 to 12% protein content. And it's really designed for short fermentation times. Uh, think of less than 12 hours. If you want to make the dough in the morning and use it that day, this would be the one that you'd want to use. The next one up in strength is going to be this one here, the, the, the red. Now the, the red comes in at a little bit higher. It's 12 to 13% protein. And it's good. Well, you can probably get about two days of good fermentation, up to maybe around 36 hours. The unique thing about this particular flower here is that at that higher protein level, if you don't use all of the dough, for example, let's say here we are, we've, we've gone 36 hours and we find that we've still got dough left, but it's beginning to get long in the tooth. It'll blow by tomorrow, we know that when we look at it. So what do we do? Yeah, before we go home tonight, simply bring it out, take it to the bench, remove it from the box, reball it, put it back into the box again, and it'll be good to go tomorrow. It'll be softened up sufficiently, it'll be ready to open up. You can get at least another day off of it after you reball it. It's a great flower, it's a good multifunctional flower. Then, for those of you who want to go over broke with the longer fermentation times, or for whatever reason you need a very, very strong protein, this one here comes in at 13.5 to 14.5% protein. All right, very, very strong flour. And it's, it's good for 30 hours plus, 36 hours plus. If you want to go 48 hours on fermentation, if you don't use it after 48 hours, you know what to do. Bring it out to the bench, reball it, get another day off of it. If you're just making uh, one of the more popular, authentic uh, Roman-style pizzas, this would probably be the, the, the selection right here, the red. That would be the one that you'd want to choose. So you've got something for everybody here, from short fermentation, same day, to moderate fermentation, uh, up to a maximum of about 36 hours, but you can reball it and get another day off of it. And this one here, 36 hours, you could reball it and get another day, or you could possibly go 48 hours, reball it, and then still get another day. It's the strongest of the bunch. Or if you want to stay with domestic flowers, you've got these two over here. Good general purpose, general application. This particular one, by the way, uh, comes in at about 11.5% protein, 11.8% protein content. This would be an excellent one for like pan-style pizzas. So if you're doing a pan-style pizza, you definitely don't want to have a 14, 14.5% 14 protein flour. You need to have a slightly lower protein flour, and this would be a great one for pan-style pizzas. Uh, this one here, uh, if you want to go for four, five, six days on, on your fermentation, on your dough balls in the cooler, this would be the, the one to choose right here. If you're doing a cracker crust, then the lower protein flour. But if you're doing a thin crispy, then you may want to consider the higher protein. It'll give you a crispier product. So again, we've got something here for everybody. These are great flowers. Uh, they're readily available now. So contact your Sarasota distributor and get yourself some Sarasota. Give it a try. I'm betting you're going to like it. Thank you.